Hello YouTube, this is Shishi she, coming to you with another video. It's not necessary, I guess it's a lock update, it's a, it's a multiple uh, uh, amount of things. Um, I'm, I've kept my, I'm keeping my niece for two days, she has two half days for fall break. Um, I live in Arizona, so the fall breaks for the schools are now. Um, my son is out a whole week, but her school district, um, they're out two half days. So, and she wanted to do a video with me because she saw my video. And um, she wants to do one with me. So I was like, um, I don't know if I'm ready to do another video. I stayed at three months. But she was like, come on, Auntie. You can do a video. You look fine. So I'm here doing a video. I'm going to introduce you guys to her. Um, she's also natural. Um, as I mentioned, well, the video that didn't actually get on YouTube. My sister is also natural. And um, my niece is natural. I'm going to show you her hair. I'm going to introduce you to her. Uh, my daughter is a cosmetologist, and she styled her hair yesterday, so it's, it's a day old. Um, but it's a nice little cute little hairstyle to wear to keep her motivated and to keep her loving her hair, basically. So let me introduce you to her right now. And her name is, I'll let her tell you her, her name. Come on over here, Maya. Get in the video. Turn around, turn around so they can see you. In the video. Okay. And go ahead and say your name. My name is Maya. Tell them how old you are. I'm eight years old. And what do you want to say um, to the YouTube people out there? Um, like um to um my mom um half I have half days on Thursday and Friday and um basically this is my very first time I never did homework, little lessons, and now I go to recess or have lunch. Okay, and you have a scare curl that you want to share with them, right? That you made. You have to look at the video. Look up at the video. Yeah. Everywhere else. Um, so go get your scare curl at this time. While she's getting her scare curl, I'm going to tell you about some of the products and yeah. the challenges that I faced um, while being um, locked. Uh, well, not being locked because there's no challenges being locked. But uh, some of the things that I've noticed since being locked, and that's mainly my scalp issues. Um, so, itchy scalp. Um, I'm still learning, you know, how to calm that down or keep it calmed down. Um, for right now, in the, in the last few days, my scalp is, feels pretty good. Um, I've been doing pretty good, um, with my scalp, but I, yeah, every once in a while I have those, those itchy, itchy moments. So this is what I'm doing in my hair now. This is my regimen every day for my hair now. Instead of using everyday water, because we have to spritz our hair when we're locked with water, um, instead of doing that every day, and because basically we have a family history of eczema, it kind of dries my skin and dries my scalp, which, which uh, that, that's where I have the, the irritation. So this is what I use, aloe vera liquid. Let me turn the bottle around. Aloe vera liquid. This is what I use in my spray bottle. This is what I spray my hair with every day, and it kind of it, it kind of could uh, limits the irritation than using regular hard water water. And I've already also tried to use bottled water. Um, I spritz my hair in a bottle like this, and this is where I put my aloe vera um, liquid in. Um, also, I use this Greg juice. Um, I add my own oils and I also put the aloe vera liquid in here too and sp spritz it on my hair. I also brush my hair, um, just lightly brush like this and shake or whatever. I brush my hair, it soothes the scalp. Um, you know, one thing that I've learned um, on this lock journey, you think just because you're locked, I've been natural for three years, but just because you're locked, you, you think that your regimen has to change a whole lot. And I learned that it necessarily does not have to change a whole lot. And I'll talk more about that in a minute. My niece is back with her scarecrow. So I'm going to let her speak to you briefly about her scarecrow and let her do a strike a couple of poses here. Uh, that she likes to do. So we're, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to let my niece speak at this time. Go ahead, Maya. Tell them about your scarecrow. Stand up. Um, my, I made my scarecrow. Yeah, we're going to look at the camera. Well, um, we were going to make our scarecrow, my scarecrow on Thursday and Friday, but my teacher said so it can be easier, we have to make half of our scarecrow on Wednesday. So we made our scarecrow. It took us three days to make our scarecrow. We didn't do 
do a whole lot on Wednesday. Basically, the only thing we did was make our stitches. Okay, stand back so they can see the whole full scarecrow. Stand back a little bit more. Okay, hold the scarecrow down so they can see it. Make, All um, right. Basically, the only thing we did was make the stitches. You have to look into the camera. No, basically, the only thing we did was make the stitches. And um, we got like, uh, we put this on. Um, I wonder if we, I don't know if we put it on Thursday or Wednesday. We'll probably put it on Wednesday. No, we put it on Thursday. And, um, we did this. We put this on. Mrs. December did all of this. I did. She stuffed all of this right here. And okay. she did all of this right here. She did all of this. Okay. So show them the scarecrow with with your with you. Pull pull the scarecrow down so they can see it. And then we're gonna end in a minute, okay? So okay, that's Maya, and we're gonna end with her together. Um, I told her when she do a YouTube video, I need like five videos for her because she can talk all day because that's what you know. She likes camera lights action, uh, pretty much. So what I was gonna say, um, pretty much as far as uh my natural hair and as far as me being a uh, locked versus my just you know being natural without being locked the regimen is not that much more different I've learned that maybe some of my solutions I have to liquefy a little bit more but I can, you can still brush your hair you can still style your hair you can still do your hair the same and I guess I was a little bit you know sensitive to my hair um, scared that I might do something that's going to change it from being locked or whatever but it hasn't. I mean, it's um, in there pretty good. Um, and if anything, it adds to it. So I, I, I've tried not to be so so light with my hair and just, just, just do my hair like normal, like I would do if my hair wasn't locked up. Uh, let me show you my hair, and then we're going to end. Um, this is my hair. Hold the, See if you can hold the video, Maya. Put this down. Hold it up for them to see. Wait, I want to see nope. your, your this face. Is, this is my hair um, right here. And I'm going to turn around so you can see the back. The back is kind of thick in the back. Here's my sides. So my hair is kind of thick in the back. But, you know, I hear a lot of people say, you know, about the frizzies. I do have the frizzy thing going on, too. My hair is thick in the back. But I actually love it. I come back the frizzies with the brush. Um, I actually love the thickness in my hair. It makes my hair thicker. I mean, it's the length is not where I want it oh because my actually my length comes down to here. But you can't tell it because, you know, everything shrinks up. But um, I actually like the thickness, and I know when the length comes, that everything will come together. You got to hold it steady, Maya. I'm telling Everything you has to come it. together steady. Um, so eventually it will. So what I'm going to do on my next uh, lock video, which will be probably December 8th, um, I will be three months at that time. And at that time, doing that lock video, I will um, do another video um, on December 8th so that you can see me at three months uh, being locked. Uh, maybe I can get my sister in some of the videos. Um, so that you can see her as well. Um, and we're going to end at this time. I just want to say God bless. Goodbye. And hopefully you guys have a good day. Maya, what do you, you want to say goodbye to them? Yeah, goodbye. Okay. Have a good day. See you next time. All right. And thank you guys for watching. And um, as always, comments is welcome. Thank you.